my beloved love. For some reason, I heard get out of the way. And it's almost like, and this won't be for everyone, take this if it resonates, it's almost like there is a powerful soulmate or a twin flame wanting to enter or re-enter your life who is interrupting the stream of thought in this reading to say, like get out of the way to this other person, which sounds kind of funny. This might actually just be the healed version of this person. Take it how it connects. But for many of you, this is someone who is trying to re-enter or enter your life at this, like higher self level, but they've been blocked because of this lower vibrational person in your life who was underappreciating you. And that might be the reason why this person has now divinely been disconnected from you, to clear the space for this other connection or this union to come in. Now, if that part of the reading is resonating, you'll definitely want to subscribe, because I feel that's going to be the next reading that we do here. So stay tuned for more details on that potential new entrance of love coming into your life. But I am going to go ahead and close the reading here. Thank you so much to all of you for being co-creators here, for sharing your own powerful, unique, beautiful soul frequency with the channel. So, I'm getting you didn't even really need to cut them off, but you refocused all of your energy and attention on your inner self, on that self-love, on listening to your own intuition, staying open, staying present, and this person did not react well to it. They may have even tried to control or convince you away from your own intuitive guidance for a while, and ultimately, they may have chosen to disconnect from you or even to just leave your life or to drop communication. But I'm hearing, calling your bluff. So do be aware that if you have felt someone tugging on your energy who recently pulled back communication or who left your life, and especially if you noticed that they did this when you really began focusing on yourself, be cautious about not reacting to the energy that this person might be sending you because I almost feel like they're trying to energetically, and again, this could be unintentional, but trying to energetically manipulate you through withdrawing their communication or their presence physically, trying to manipulate you into being the one to either apologize or to reach out to them, or to give them even more of your time and energy when you've already been very firm about focusing that energy on yourself, and of course, as you should, because that's really where your intuition has been guiding you at this time. So, I do recommend tuning in on those times and days if it feels aligned for you, because we also have a live chat feature during those events. The live chat is particularly powerful, because this is where we can all interact as a community, and of course, you are all co-creators here, sharing your own beautiful unique soul frequency with the channel. So, by doing that through the live chat, we are actually, in a sense, manifesting for each other, mutually uplifting and supporting each other at that vibrational level. From Divine Muscular Type Yes, if you believe.